game, everyone. Thanks for tuning in to 2K Sports. We've got some NBA action for you coming up. We'll watch the Toronto Raptors in this one as they go up against the Houston Rockets. Kevin Harlan here with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg, and we'll have David Aldridge filling us in from the sideline. Here's the starting group for Houston. They've got Smith. Fred Van Bleed out there with Mr. Fundamentals. Then there's Buddy Heald. And it's Landale in at the center. And for Toronto, big men in the four form. It's Siakam and Pirtle. Then it's OG and Anobi. Then there's McDaniels. And it's Flynn in at the point guard position. And the latter half for this season, uh, Greg, in your experience, did the games get easier or harder than it was earlier on? Overall, I'd say it's harder later on. Physically, you're more banged up. And, and mentally, man, it's a long season. And that can wear on you as well. So the Rockets win the tip. Van Vliet against Flynn. Here's Mr. Fundamentals. Coming off a solid outing against Indiana. Back to Smith to the right side. Lock at six. Hey, yo, right here. Here's Mr. Fundamentals. He's guarded by Ananobi. Mr. Fundamentals, that's good. And with the final votes tally, MP led his conference, and Greg will serve as an all-star captain. And Kevin has got to bring a ton of joy and confidence to a guy like MP. Now he'll get to put on his GM hat and pick the best all-star team he can. I'm interested to see who his early selections end up being. Greg talking about Jakob Pertl. It doesn't seem like he gets enough credit for his defense. I don't think he does. I mean, he's an excellent rim protector and rebounder and a big man who just takes pride in defending. Now, here's Siakam. Following the miss by Jabari Smith. Get outside! Now Flynn. He gives a bit of a scoring lift to the team, averaging eight points a game. Toronto needs to get off a shot. With three, Siakam. That shot off the mark. And so Van Vliet will bring it up for the Rockets. This, their first look at this year's Toronto squad. And with this matchup being an East versus West affair, it will be the first of only two meetings between the teams. And, you know, there's always a bit of a feeling out process in that first game between opponents. A lot different than when you've played a team you're familiar with. They need this one. And again, Toronto, no up. Houston leading by four. Going inside. Great crossover to get free. Mr. Fundamentals got six. Toronto's gone over four from three-point lane to start out. Can pull from outside. So if you look at the Rockets' struggles, uh, Clark, over the last few seasons, what stage the season start and the Rockets are among the youngest teams in the NBA? Okay, that works. Let's get it, man, back on defense. <laughs> Houston's front office aggressively adding quality bets like Fred Van Lee in hopes of stabilizing that roster. Now, here's Trent. And you can see his scoring totals. Those are some pretty good numbers. He's putting up close to 15 points a game on average. Here's Thompson and the pass to Mr. Fundamentals. Yo, yo, watch him. Healed outside. Six to shoot. To the middle. Couldn't find that opening, but I had to just play off ball. They have owned the paint so far. You know how the AI be sometimes, bro. And Acting you know like they all Kawhi Leonard. Like, bro. Gives you a big it's this is my career, man. Chill out. <clears throat> they just told me to get in the weight room. The defense gives, that's what he takes. A sign of a skilled offensive player. And a big concern for players and coaches is the Damn. consistency what? of officiating. He check, he check. It's tough when one night something is a foul and the next night it is. Uh, there's some gray area, obviously. And it'd be good for the league to try and clarify how they want things called. And now the latest from our reporter, David Alden. Siakam out here playing like the old school Ben Simmons, dog. He scored an incredible Got him running point guard. Points, and as always, well, he just moving the ball up court, but still. Doing whatever he wanted at that the screen. Those are and numbers Let's go. Up. Couldn't possibly top that tonight. 
goodie? We'll find out They've been the having a good defense all game, though. David, yeah, it was a Shit. special night for him. The team really fed off his energy. Yeah, the catalyst for that win, it, it was an effort that I'm sure he's hoping to replicate tonight. Yeah, you know, all indications are that he feels good coming into this. One. Feels confident that he can build on that prior success. Just a solid performance on the interior. The rebounding has been off the charts. Yeah, you look across the board, it's actually sizing up, shaping up to be a great game. I mean, strong performances throughout, and they've really been strong on the glass. Now, over here is Siakam. Look at Siakam doing his team, bro. Shot clock at five. Hand up. Siakam for three. Let's go. Two hands is better than one. You know, guys, this has been far from his best game. A disappointing outing for both him and the team. Come here. Oh, gee, the long Take him. And athleticism up and down the Easy. For the Raptors. It is something. <clears throat> yeah, they, they have a tight that they're looking for blocks, steals, deflections. I like how I got gold, midi magician, but as y'all seen right there, like my my shooting bar was nowhere to be found. Like, what the hell? No, nah, you shouldn't have reached for that. It's cool. I don't think he's making that. Let's go. And so Van Vliet will Come here, give me that. The they lead by the biggest margin of the game, 15 points. Here's Mr. Step on him. Well, you have got to be kidding me, bro. Am I the only one that has issues with the layup bars? Like, this shit's crazy. He's covered closely. I started the layup off. The, the green the green bar was there. And then by the time I got to the end of it, the green bar disappeared. It's like, bro, come on now. Make up your mind. Mr. Fundamentals passes to the this dude here. Sorry, I get it back. Twenty nine seconds left to play here in the second. The screen. Tear drop. That one falls through. It's his sixth make from the floor this game. Now six for ten. Hurdle kicks to McDaniels. Pass to Siakam. Launches a three. Sinks the triple. Siakam's got the shot. Siakam. Should have been doing that because you didn't let your team get down. Like I said, I don't even know how y'all got this far. That's crazy. Good screen, boy. And the catching the body. The finish was nice, but the setup was better yeah ga the pick working to full effect before the stuff and you know not enough help from the defense there to compensate he gets a clean let's get in two three so i ain't gotta chase exactly nothing you draw it up. No one covered. he hit that too all around game of siakam so adept at working the ball to open guys you know what you love seeing from pascal got him siakam is his confidence oh you have got to be kidding me dude especially when it comes to scoring pascal understands how valuable Bro, I got to go check this dude OG's defense out man cuz like that nigga was locking me down last game too I ain't gonna cap I think I in that game was like 35 I think but he still made it tough as fuck to get 35 what the heck? What shit Jabari 16 in his home country of Serbia so even though he's still young he's already a lifer in his near decade as an NBA assistant coach, he made a name for I'm tripping. I totally forgot I put us in 2-3. Totally forgot. With the rebuilding Raptors. Let me get the ice over real quick. Love his resume. His story is oh, got him. He is just Step on him. Oh, my gosh. Mr. Let's go. That's good. They're getting on a roll inside. Their last three field goals have come from the paint. Watch the screen. Outside Flynn. And an Obi with it. He's been a reliable scorer for him as he's averaging up over 13 points a game. At the elbow, Smith. Count the bucket coming off a perfectly placed assist. Good shit. Smith's Way to make all that count. Let's go. A nice start to the second half. Just one miss in their first five attempts. And there's the pass to Purdy. And it's a defensive three second violation. And he's got his first chance at the line here. And he's putting together a solid year at the free throw line. 79% overall. Guys, he's slightly fallen off his pace from a year ago at the line. And those points from the strike have been a little harder to come by. And no good on the technical, so unable to pick that one up. He missed a freebie. Let's go. 
Here is Flynn. Still yet to score. Mm -mm. This one we play these good defenders, bro. 2K always has to like amp them up. Siakam's got a pair of threes now here in the third for Toronto. Van Vliet passes to Mr. Fundamentals. Like Drew Holiday and Schroeder even be locking up like my point guard. I'm like, man, come on. Good shit, boy. Simply a great play. Smith Jr. making that play look easy. Oh, man, Glad that shit is crazy. Can't even move. I'm finna work off the ball then. I keep forgetting it. 2 3. I'm glad he missed that. Work off the ball. Oh, excuse me. Going to the hoop. You in my way. <laughs> Let's go, boy. That's how it's supposed to be looking, but this dude OG is playing one hell of a defensive game, bro. I'm not even finna cap. I've, like, never been locked down like this. Dude is playing his awesomeness. Come on. Come on, screen him. Off the screen. Slap. Let's go, baby. I got to work off the screen, bro. He, hey, he's, hey, he's playing way too good of a defensive game. I got to work off the screen. Well, I'm going to credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. Up in time. And the last second attempt is not Come on, y'all telling me but Jabari throw that jump full court? Come on, dude. <laughs> nah, come on. Rockets leading by 18. To the wing right side. You non set the screen like I just had to go up there. Come on, bro. Oh, man, y'all gonna throw this fourth quarter, I see. All right. That's to Boucher. To Siakam. Toronto working the ball around now. And the rebound goes to the Rockets. Let's get a timeout up here, bro, because I'm non liking this lineup. Let's just let's get a little timeout real quick. Uh uh. Easy. He's too small. We got to take advantage of those moments. What a sensational finish. You got to be able to get some hang time to do that one. Try to put this game out of reach. We need to go back to man. Let's go back to man. Let's go back to man. Awesome rewind courtesy of the AT&T 5G Slam Camp. As soon as we go back to man, you get exposed. Give me that. Come on. Come on. Good and a nice shot from Mr. Fundamentals. Yeah, that's too good a look to give them from behind the arc. I got yours, I got yours. Outside Flynn, the pass to Siakam. That's all you. Fires from deep. <laughs> Flynn misses. Houston's gone downtown 13 times in this game, and they're just over. Did you just see that step? On three. Come on, yeah, man. You can always count on Van Bleet to Boy, hit him with that right SpongeBob. Stabbing on the beat. Do -do 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 -do. Come on, bro. The crowd is silent right now, bro. They cannot believe what just happened. Did he just teleport? Instant transmission? Come on, girl. Listen, Here's Mr. Fundamentals. He's guarded by Ananobi. Shot by Mr. Fundamentals. Man, no amazing defense Toronto by this dude. Three or seven from the Not even from the cap. That's a 42% mark in the quarter. Dude really got me forcing shots up today. On the wing, good pick Ananobi. up, good pick up, good pick up. Pass to McDaniels. What we in? What we in? Talk to me. Hello. Uh-uh. <laughs> He's slapping. Oh, wow. Come on. Y'all would call a foul on Fred. He'll go to the line with a chance for three. Damn, Fred. Yeah, Game don't go by without you getting a foul, there, bro. On the three -point attempt. You have to avoid fouls like that. As a defender, challenge a three-point shooter, but run by him, not into him. Houston with a big group substitution here. Atari Eason's checked in for Jock Landale. Jay Shanti comes in for Jabari Smith. Reggie Bullock, he's checked in for Buddy Heal. And it's Thompson in for Fred Van Vliet. And it's Thompson with the ball. He'll bring it up for the Rockets. Really hard to think of things they didn't do well in this one. Certainly a dominant night on offense, 
for Houston. It was a standout performance across the board. I mean, it was like watching a cat play with a mouse, and they were able to do more or less. There wasn't no damn foul. And on the year now, tonight's impending we heard the body contact all the way at the top of the stadium. Bro, you have got to be kidding me right now. To get a feel for a team. But Damn. Came out and made the necessary adjustments and I like that, though, because when you, you know what I'm saying? When you're not up against a well, you know, defender or whatever, like your badges are just so OP. They're so OP. Then, so when you get up against a good defender, dude, you got to remember, like, man, he got defending badges. determined. <laughs> to take this one it's oh. gonna be a happy flight home yep to have a stress-free win on the road see last week's uh video bro i let loose and Obi did not let me play my game this game bro i don't even think i got my goat skills activated dude was playing an amazing game bro if y'all want to be here for the next uh next week's video bro hit the like button hit the subscribe hit the noti bell just like the song see <laughs> And we'll catch y'all next time. Yo, tell him. We out this time. He's guarded by Ananobi. That shit crazy. Mr. Fundamentals, no good. Amazing defender, bro. Thompson against Flynn. So we see the Rockets taking the win here. This crowd was stunned by the manner in which their team was dismantled. Yeah, you know what? Shocking. I don't care what the matchup is. You never expect a road team to come in and just cruise to the kind of win they did tonight. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. For Clark Kellogg, Greg Anthony, and...